Hey man, you can know your watch. Dance Alright everyone, you don't know who this already, this are the skiller, you see what I say? And before me tell you know, what we in the comments say about the whole shooting a Spanish town we check we take place from Chedwin Avenue to, to Brunswick and from Chedwin Park to Brunswick Avenue and Job Lane or Jobs Lane because you know some people call it Job, some call it Jobs, you see me? More have to say something about this youth named Kevin Burrell, one of the civilians that is a victim of the whole shooting. This youth fly down from from somewhere from foreign right come to a nine night thing cousin as a as it was reported you know it's a nine night and um come for the nine night and just at the wrong place at the wrong time right the white ad wagon with the three police officers that do the shooting in a collided in a theme one and the shootout take place and it's not only him did inside of that vehicle there was other people as well in the vehicle with him you see me and them get hurt serious injuries so them they are hospital at this moment you see me so my condolences to the friends and the family of this young man that is called kevron borrell all right there is actually three persons that died two civilian one rogue cop as can into in in the com you see me i say because the three police officers is known as rogue cop you see me all right this is all the thing going on see in the com, what the commissioner of police to give them a full explanation as owing to the police officers them gain access to certain things being the fact that they are on suspension and should not be in any position of anything for police officers like that. You see me I say? No. I could start it back from the top because I know a lot of people still don't get what happened because this shooting incident is a mix up and some people just not like read. You see me? But I just circle. Alright. It all started at Chedwin Park where Sheldon Daly was murdered by one of the rogue cop. Right? Another police officer was there and see when Sheldon get hurt. Challenged the rogue police. And him got in the, the white AD wagon and fled the scene with two more other police officers in it. That white, that white AD wagon is a police service vehicle. Indicom says. You see me? Indicom give their report and said that is that is a, a police service vehicle. Alright, watch this now. While giving chase, shot was being exchanged from both vehicles. You see me? I say? Until the white AD wagon collided into Kevin, Kevin, Kevron Burrell's car. You see me, I say? At this, uh, the, this, the shooting stopped at a right at Brunswick um, Avenue and, and Jobs Lane or Jobs Lane because some people call it Jobs Lane, some people call it Jobs Lane, and you know, it, we don't say it, you know, but the spelling is the same. You see? Alright. So while while the shooting at Guano, Kevron was shot and killed on the spot. There was three more other people, as I tell you, in the v, in the silver. Kevron was, which is Mr. Burrell was driving the silver AD wagon. The rogue police officer with the tree man was driving the white AD wagon. Is that me I said to you? All right. Now the police officer will give chase. No name, nothing. In the camera, they now disclose that brother because that man right now, that man right now. Trust me, you see me? So you're not going to hear nothing about that man. That man is like a hero to enough people right now. You see me? Alright, but here we go now, you see me? So, the silver, the silver AD wagon is where Burrell in it. Him get shot and there was three more other people in it. The white AD wagon got shot up and so forth. One of the police officers died. You see me? I said, one was injured and one fled the scene at the time of the shooting. You get me? Now, all of this said and done now, and everything, you know, in the come touching for them investigation. And this is what really is the bad problem now. In the come would like the commissioner of police to give them a full, full report as into how these following things happen. Number one, these three police officers was on suspension. 
for some murder activity scene but only two surviving now so the two what did they know them have court going on at this moment for two separate murder cases and so I say police officers murder cases two separate that is what Indicom says is going on you see me the matter says a whole of confusion now in the meanwhile that I go on with the three officers of the pond sitting there suspension them end up gaining access to a white AD wagon which is a police service vehicle with the blue light we we'll go up on top of it if you do a siren thing you know and go through the crowd and watch the device you know what I say member know them on suspension them also have access them also get access to some to, to a peer like two peers of um two sitting there we call it um the, the license plate the license plate that I go up on the vehicle, you see me I say, with the papers in the vehicle, plus I talk about the plate itself, you know, the inside of the vehicle put on. Plus the vehicle already have plate outside. You get what I say to you? So basically, you know what that means. That's like a, some James Bond thing. One crime, change the plate, put on a different one. That's why basically state to Indicom. You see me? Indicom wants to know how is it that then get in the vehicle have five firearms and three of them are from outside of the, the um out of the police station. That's the next thing in the come want um we call it want the commissioner of police <laughs> to give a, a full explanation towards that thing. You see what I said to you? You see. And on top of it of all things, you see what I said to you? With some more equipment and all these things. You see me? And in the come state say them have them them not really finish give a, a full um forensic on the weapons being used or the weapons them find inside of the vehicle you see what i say all right now up till now enough people are trying to find out who is this police officer that took down these rogue cop you see what i say no people with something like this what just happened you see what i say you know sefim name now got this close you get what I said to you because this man is like a hero, not only to the police force, but to enough people with the inner the community. You see what I said to you? From this thing happen, me hear a whole heap of voice note where we issue out online and a bag of name and call and all these things. You see what I say? And how much people them do and how much you see me, we don't need to hear that. Me, I tell you exactly what in the come set tone you see me i said to you we don't want to hear say now nah, no mix up now this thing you get to me i said to you yeah now the biggest thing in the come one know is how oh, is it that while in custody how oh, is it that a police officer escape custody right and when i talk the one to flee the scene you know we are talking the police officer that was injured oh a police officer that was in police custody how him escape custody these answers indicom are asked indicom me not tell you like yo indicom why me not tell you like yo indicom really really do a scary thing for police officers you see me i say you see me but um that's a good question you see me oh boy three person was hurt in the whole thing just a recap it a three person get hurt tonight sheldon daily kevron um, Burrell and the Corporal Rohan Williams. These three persons was killed in the whole of this. All of this scenario will take place. Is it? And um, in the come, I do some terrible investigation. They want to know how police escape custody and them injured at that. How them get possession of the gun from out of the police station. How them get police service vehicle with all the blue light panther pie. You yes, see what I say? And all these things and these police officers was supposed to be suspended with no access to none of these things you get me i said to you yeah. everybody want to know who is this man where we unfold this injustice where did that go on eh, eh. you know said so that now gonna happen the man needing safety this is a big work for him do and that's how Indicom has stated. As I said, if you notice Indicom, them, them want to mention that man name. Indicom, them touch that man. If you don't mind, that man probably end up working for Indicom. You understand? 
Yeah, can we get to understand the police officers don't like in the com? You see, but I don't say thing, but anyways, you don't know some me dancer skill. I'm just a bring two new work one. You see, me I say, me now nah, go get up and play no voice note. I call no bag a name and these things. Me not depend that. It's just where this was state as fact. Me deal with. You know, so me I say, we know we don't want to put on nobody. You see, me I say, so if you're new to my channel, don't be afraid to click the subscribe button. You see, me I say, leave your comment and let me know what you think. And as always, I don't know anything already. My name is Skiller and this way you just see and watch is the Dancer Skiller ENT. This was the update and the Indicom and in the, in, in, in Indicom about the Spanish Town shooting take place over the weekend with um from Chedwin Avenue to Brunswick from Chedwin Park, Brunswick Avenue and um Job uh, or Jobs Lane and call it. Alright, on go up so that clear up a lot of things for me. So may I say you don't know the thing go already. Big up on yourself. Hey, my you, you know where you watch. Dance, dance, dance. Yeah, man. Hey. hey, yo, Skiller. You are watching Dance on Skiller. Tint. Dance on Skiller.